<laughs> all right, I'm just going to record all of this. <laughs> I may or may not cut this out. All right. We're having a lot of she fun. She doesn't edit. <laughs> yeah, I don't oh, edit. She does not edit. All right. No. Hi, guys. Mixed Media Girl here. We are here with Stone Cold Countertops, Catherine and Mike. Um, and we're going to do a fun project for you today. Mike is going to show me something new here. Um, but just to explain our materials real quick, we're using the Stone Coat Countertops Art Coat. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> yeah, they know where I got that. Um, yep. And then some of the white base tint. Holla, holla. And then some of the real teal metallic. Real teal. Let me make sure. It matches yep, your you phone can see case. that. Yeah, it does. <laughs> and then we may or may not use a little bit of the bronze metallic mica powder. So we've got everything mixed up. And um, yeah, I'm going to kind of let Mike take it from here and show us what's up. So this is the clear resin. What's up, guys? Mike here with StoneCookCountertops.com with Mixed Media Girl. We're about to have some fun. We're going to do some clear on this white canvas. And then I'm going to use a little bit of isopropyl alcohol, a little bit of purple spray paint, a little bit of black spray paint. Give it a little bit of contrast. Hit that with the alcohol. Watch it fracture, but I don't know if it's going to because I have not used this exact paint before. Yeah, so this is going to be an experiment. So what I'm going to do, actually, is while you're doing that, I'm going to zoom in on the painting so we can see that up close. And I'm going to stand up and go over there and shake these cans a little bit. Shake it like, it's, like, right. a, shake it like it's hot. Nice. There we go. We're zoomed in a little bit more on the painting. So what I do when I do this is I'll paint MDF um, a very, very light color to get this effect, and then I'll, I'll, I'll hit this over it. So basically that's what we have here is just a light background color. Right. So that's just clear, guys. I know it looks like it's white, but it's just clear. Okay, now clear. I have messy hands, so you want me to switch gloves out so I don't get uh, yuckies on your spray? No. You don't care? I will just get a new bottle. Okay. <laughs> All right. All you right. guys already got yuckies on it, so don't worry about it. All right. No. <laughs> we did. I'm sorry. It's okay. Okay, I'm going to just miss this just a hair. Oh, I'm excited. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. <gasps> All right. All right. Just Ready? a little bit. Yep, yep, yep. And time is of the essence when you do this, and you don't want too much paint. Does it make it cure faster? Um, no, it, 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 it'll it sink okay. into the resin and won't get this reaction. Uh, now we have the real teal. Okay, this is the alcohol with the real teal mica powder. It's a 91% isopropyl alcohol, so Good. it's really Which important. You can't see any of the teal, but that's okay. A little bit will come out, so it's, it, it is fogging just a hair. See yeah, a see how it's color? breaking everything up? That's cool. So now you have a cool background yeah, fractured. to a painting, and I like okay. that purple Yeah, and black. I see the teal is getting a little And now if you do uh, a painting on there, I think you got a really cool background really fast, right? Right. Whew. Okay, now I have the pressure of not messing this up. That's, that's cool, though, right? That is actually So that's, really that's one cool. of our countertop tricks, obviously, but it works great for a background. Wow. Yeah, okay. Right. And then what, what you'll see too with the isopropyl, it'll create these circles. And when you don't want them, like we, we, cause this thing's going to web out and really move. Mm -hmm. And all you got to do is just tap it and it'll, it it'll then just not be so perfect. You don't want like perfect circles. You know what I mean? I, I do like a perfect circle. See, that's the difference between me and you, Marcy. <laughs> <laughs> right here, you touch that one no, she likes it. Okay. All right. <laughs> well, I'm going to be messing with it anyway, so I will probably... I can't wait to see. I'm going to go I'm on the excited. other side. Now I right. feel a lot of pressure. Wasn't that okay. easy, though? Wasn't that... That wasn't... was. That's really cool. Really fast, really cool, and if you are... I like that purple in there. Yeah, I like Not that as good, yeah. All right, so let's get in here with some of this white base tint. Nice. And I'm also curious what reactions this will cause doing this on top of the surface that was, you know, mm -hmm. just misted with alcohol and whatnot. Kind of a bit of a reverse. Yeah. Right. It's fun to think outside the, the Yeah, box. this so I think we're all I mean, is have you guys tried this before? Yes. Yes. Oh you have. Yes. <laughs> but that's okay. We're so it's you new for new. me. You know what's really cool? What you should try to what you put is in. spray a little bit of black spray paint on that paint stick. And yeah. drag it through there too. Oh yeah, that's it will react Yeah, I've seen you paint. guys do that. And, the and you don't have to. Let's give black. it a go. Yeah. Okay. Both of those would be so, like next level. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead. This is the purple. You yeah. can do that too. Okay, just like that. So uh -huh. if it's flat, obviously wider. Yep, on the end it's narrower, sharper images. Ooh. Yeah. Super rad, right? That's cool. Ooh. You're welcome. <laughs> 
Right? <laughs> That's cool. It's fun. I mean, the reaction. It is fun. And see, it's hard to see those on camera sometimes, how cool that really looks. Yeah. Right? Let me actually make sure we're zoomed in enough. Make sure we really can see that on this camera. Let's see. I'm going to zoom in a little bit more. One second. Okay. There we go. Got you zoomed in a little better. All right. So you were telling me. I was I saying, you, know, the alcohol? you could on a stick and just drag it right through that purple, and that'll cause cool effects. You can drag other colors right, and what I'll typically do is drag them right through the center and then move it with air or the heat gun, nice. and it creates fun effects. Okay. The more they because, and, and I don't like to swirl it with sticks because I think you move it with air, it looks more like organic, more natural. Yeah. Well, I'm going to kind of think, like, I actually love the videos where you kind of do striations through. Nice. Like, honestly, those are my favorite. Because it's like stone, you know? Right. It's my favorite. The sediment style is my favorite. Yeah. Yep. So and I think I'm going to kind of go for that on this painting. Nice. This is the bronze. I did definitely decide to use that, obviously. Yeah. I love this bronze. <laughs> yeah. It, like, jumps off of it's whatever you use very it on. pretty. Right. Okay. Don't worry, I got this. Oh yeah, yeah you, you do. do. Oh yeah, I never panic. You, you, don't you told to. me I got this. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> you do. You can literally work until you're happy. You yeah, know? right. And the working time is so long. Right, tons of so, time to play with it. This is the um, the art coat, guys. So it's got about a 45 minute, probably more though. I think maybe more like an hour in, work time. In this time. temperature, you have well over an hour. Yeah, you it's know. not hot in here. What is it, like 70 degrees or probably. 68 yeah, or something? Probably about 70 is my guess. Yeah, it's not cold or hot, really. But normally in Los Angeles, it's like crazy hot. Oh, yeah, we get in there with the teal now. Nice. Okay, this is going to be fun. There you go. That looks cool. Yeah. Wow. I like how that pops. I like how you're starting at one end, too, and it's tapering off at the other end. That's kind of cool. Yeah. So I'm going to play around with this a little bit until I'm happy with it. Because that's the cool thing is that you can literally just keep working it until you are happy with it. So I think I want to use the teal as more of like an accent color mm -hmm. and not do too much on that. Sure. Cool. I would probably get some black in there, baby. Black? Yeah. I think you could frame Where's that. Where's that black yeah, spray? This one? Over there, yeah. Okay, let's go ahead in there. Oh, my God. And a little goes a long <laughs> way. Right. It's <laughs> all good. It's the, it's the rest of the slide, slide right slide. out of my hand. Okay. Yes. So we got a little black spray paint on here. Yeah. I'm just going to spray for you. Yeah, maybe. Okay. We can do teamwork. Okay. All right. Awesome. Especially, I think, with that white base coat. Uh -huh. Right. That's going to have some fun yep. reactions. It does. It'll definitely. When we're doing like together. Carrera Marble Look, that's what we do. We'll rub black through the white base, and it what it does for you is so cool. Mm hmm. And I might even hit this with a heat gun. I think yeah. that's a great idea. I might do that. To kind of bring it a bit all together. That's what, know? yep, that's what I, I want. I want to get do. a little more purple in here, though. I think that purple is that. Okay. Yeah. I like that you used the same stick to build those two colors together. Have you ever used really purple cool. or any spray paint in your pieces before? Mm -mm. All right. Well, no, no, except just like as like a background, you know? It's like mixed media. Yeah. No, I will tell you, the spray paint is my favorite. I think I think I look at look at what that's already doing. That. Yeah, let's hit it with the heat gun oh, and yeah. see what happens. Oh yeah, who knows? You know? Oh yeah, it'll either light on fire. Or... No, <laughs> I'm gonna go full speed ahead. Oh yeah. I like how that underpainting is still coming through in little windows, yeah. you know? That's sweet. Okay. Now I feel like this end actually doesn't entirely go with that end. Mm -hmm. So we're going to tilt. That's I like it. I was totally thinking the same thing. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. We're so in sync. And we're going to make this 
I love the tilt because it just, I, I feel like it oh, really, really brings sweet. everything together. Right. And it's going to make some really exciting things happen. Look at that. That's cool, man. I like it. Can I back my feet this way? I don't know what you guys think. I like I, it. That, I that, like that, it. That under spray paint's actually acting a little different in, in that semi gloss where it's almost more more polka dotty, right, mm -hmm. Catherine? Right. So right. gloss is gonna give you a little different look, but I like I like that. I, I like that. That look there a lot. I like how that just became a very fine line. Right. Yeah. That's cool. sweet. Definitely. Yeah, that's definitely so. So just play around with the techniques, guys. I think that's going to continue to marble too for the next few minutes. Yes. And I'm going to go ahead and really quick torch it. What oh, about I love that. what about this? Yeah. What uh -oh. about tilting it this way and that way just a hair? Or do you want to keep those tighter? Ooh. Do you like it tight? I like those lines. Okay. Yeah. All right. We'll leave it. <laughs> I worry. That makes me worry. <laughs> hey, you know, I'm the same way, Marcy, where you're not afraid to say leave it alone. Like, that's yeah. good. Yeah. Sometimes it's like the hardest part is not right. continuing to go. Oh, look at how it's selling out over here. Yeah. Isn't that rad? That's cool. I just love that. All these tiny little, th and the, in the next few minutes, that's going to do it more and more. So I just love that. It'll continue to do that with that working time. Yeah. You got good light on it too. It's awesome. Good. Yeah. No glare on that pretty much. That's good. Okay. Awesome. Let's go ahead and do a close up real quick. That is so cool. All right. We're starting over here on the left hand side actually. I wish normally I start on the right side. But look at all those colors together. That is just gorgeous. And the black and the teal together. Yeah. Beautiful. This is a really fun color combo, actually. So you see those little, like, speckles? That's from the spray paint and the alcohol, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, misting those together and whatnot created those fun effects. Right, and it's, it's because of the different style that it was. Yeah. So it's a new new type of product for us to use for the, the spray paint. That's not the typical sure. one we use, but it created some really interesting texture. Yeah. So you definitely want to play with that and make your samples. And that tilt them. made that thing work. <laughs> it did, yeah. It looks amazing. All right, here we go. All right, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Definitely. One, what I always say is do not be afraid to experiment, right? Try out different materials together. See how they all work together. And so... <laughs> Hope you enjoyed this. Don't oh, forget to subscribe cool. if you haven't. And from Mixed Media Girl and Stone Countertops, you, you got, got this. You got this.